Hi, I'm Corky of Corky's Pest Control. Before we put your home on our service, there's a lot of planning that we have to do depending on how many plants you have in your backyard and what kind they are. Come on and let me show you around this yard. We inventory the plantings on your property to see what is drawing the insects, and then we check them to see what insects might be present. We always make sure to inspect the ground cover too to find out what might be under there. Our job is to find out which plants on your property are drawing the plant attacking bugs, which in turn draw the ants and spiders. So when you find one, you always find the other. In this case, it's a citrus tree. Ants have two stomachs, one which is a social stomach that they take the liquid into from the insects that suck the juice out of your plants, like aphids and whitefly. So the first thing that we have to do is we have to set up a repellency to take away the, ant, or the whitefly and the aphids from your plant. When we can do that, there's no food source from them or not enough to feed a giant colony, so they'll have to move on and go someplace else. Trees like this that need fertilizer are under stress. They will attract more of these aphids and whitefly to them, so it needs to be fertilized in order to bring it back to its perfect health, which will repel some of these plant attacking insects. Whitefly can be a major problem in backyard plantings. Controlling the whitefly will help control the ants. This is a great place for ants to build their colonies. It's a great ground cover, a really good place for them to be. They have the shelter there and they have the water. Their food is very close by at these citrus trees that we were just looking at. Knowing why the ants are here and where they're going to live is the secret of pest control. When we do a plant inventory on your property, we especially note the roses, the citrus trees, the conifers, hibiscus plants, things that the sucking insects will attack and note the bottom of them where the ants will build their satellite colonies. This is a perfect example of why you need experienced eyes on your property like a Corky's Pest Control technician. You see how this dirt is pushed up against the side of the house? Obviously the dog has made a place to lay there. This is where the, the dry rot happens, the damp rot happens. It's where the termites come through the ground and come into your house. It's an example of exactly what happens to your property. You notice that this ground is, needs to be pulled back. We spray repellents around the house, the foundation, underneath the window casings, door frames. We actually spray up the sides of the house. Depending on how long it is between treatments and how long you want it to be between treatments will depend on whether we use a botanical that is short lasting or the longer lasting residual sprays. When you have the experienced eyes of a professional pest control technician on your property, they can point out all of the little problems that you might have that will stop a lot of insect invasions and a lot of rodent invasions and other things that might happen to your yard before they even begin. All animals, including insects, need food, water, and shelter to survive. If we can get rid of one or all of those, we can control your insect problem. So let us put one of our experienced technicians on your property. Call Corky's Pest Control. Corky's Pest Control, we're here for you. Call 1-800-901-1102. Corky's!